Oh, the left hand side. We, we have Team Bradford with Mango on the Lily and Brad Bucket on the Phoenix. Ten seconds. On the right side, we have Team Weak Potatoes with Rumbus on the Junkrat and Merc on the Oreo. Alright, it seems. Space Crab, yep, Space Crab, absolutely Space Crab. Alright, let's, let's see the talents. We have the Arsenal Synergy in a, again. The Serpent I'm dying. Yeah, the Serpent Talent on the Lily, put some English on it for the Giant Red. And the Righteous Assault for the Oriole. With the cool yeah, reaction. Yeah, nothing on the too sweep. spectacular. Oh, there comes the first mine. That's great. The poke has started. Alright, the comes slow the is coming out. At, yeah, there's an engage. A blind from the Lily. Nice thing. I mean, the, the blind of the Lily against the Junk Red. That's actually pretty strong. Yeah. Oh, that was a missed opportunity on the mine. And oh, there yeah, comes oh, the... there comes the mine. Great. Great. Space Crab looking for a way to engage? Yeah. I think we should just call him Space Crab for now. Yeah, um, it's not. It's, it's, it's his official name. He gets, unit. he gets rooted, but nothing too serious. Retreats a little bit, pokes a little bit more against the junk red, while Lily clears the lane. And he gets oh, almost rooted again. Now he gets rooted, and, and there thrown comes the, into. Nah, he blinks there comes out. The dodge. Yeah, great thing. Space crab is not seeing that one. <laughs> oh God, space crab, stop it, please. <laughs> <laughs> we should call all hot heroes like their dumps down names. Yeah, totally no. Uh, all right, then another throw attempt with a grenade. But we've seen a lot, a little bit of damage against the structures of the red team right now. Grenade mayhem guy keeping up that poke. Uh, for now, no. what? Did you did did you just call him Grenade Mayhem guy? Yeah. Yes. No, we just <laughs> take the real name. All right, Lily gets uh, <laughs> Lily gets thrown away, and yeah, Phoenix keeps poking against the structures of the red team. Wave clear a little bit more on the side of the blue team. Yeah. Ah, nice dodge on the mine. That was actually a, uh, that was actually a strong big shot. I don't know what what it's called, but I, I will just. I actually it. still don't see the, the the game on the live stream. What? Why don't you see the game on the live stream? I don't know. It's still the draw the the lobby screen. I'm just gonna refresh it. Really yeah, do it. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, okay, so but. Seriously, broken, I think. Yeah. Okay, Another no, route against the uh, against the phoenix. Missing the, uh, missing the mine to throw him, but I think he will get rooted again. Yeah, there it is, the root again, and there is the mine, and nope, not the blink out. He just walks, he just casually walks out of the tower range. Why not? Yeah, I do it sure. like this myself every time. Sure. Why not? And both members of both teams are again on the lane itself. Alright, there's the poke just continues, preventing the Phoenix from uh, regenerating his whole shield. He That's keeps a little key bit back. You don't want him to regenerate his shield all the time, right. so you have to keep a stable poke up. That's right. Alright, talent time! We have the slow on the Ooh, we have a we have a throw the on the um, on on the Phoenix. Eating a few tower shots and a few grenades from the um, Junkrat. Grenade mayhem guy. <laughs> Junkrat. <laughs> Root on the Lily and a bit, little bit of damage on her. But... Alright, yeah, we have the slow on the t uh, on the blinding winds. More damage, or better said, more slows on the Plasma Cutter. Radius on the Sacred Swipe and the Taste of Explosion's Quest. Right, more damage on as the expected. grenades, as expected. Nothing too serious here. That's uh, actually I'm quite impressed with the amount of wave clear on the side of uh, breadfruit. I would have thought with Oriole and um, and 
Oh, you totally confused me with his name. Jugred. <laughs> with Oriel and Jugred, you would uh, have more wave clear than Phoenix and Lily. And the thing is, Jugred actually does not have wave clear till level 20. Yeah, that's right. I you can always use forget. his super wave clear, then it's okay, but you should not do that. Yeah, I always forget. High cool but still. we have the first point on the side of the blue team. The gate has fallen. Yes. Beep. And I mean the big uh, ball, uh, the range auto attack from... Oh, Phoenix. there goes a lot of damage to the Junk Red. The second point for finished, finished off by a blinding wind. Number three. Point number three. One point from the kill, one Bookie. point from... <laughs> the, sp the spooky... Uh, <laughs> the spooky Probius is. <laughs> is the correct... Is the correct plural of Probius Probii? I don't think you can. Well, in Latin it would be correct to say Probii, but I'm not sure. Um, that goes point number four. Yeah, now they're just going ham. <laughs> <laughs> they know it. <laughs> For sure. Alright, okay, so another mine attempt. Not going to happen. The trap laying out. And. Please. Just keeping up the safe play. Right. One, one and a half minutes left. Minute, so. 20 minutes, seconds left. Yeah. And we see pressure against the well. Well is down. The with well is down. Thing. That's point number four. I now guess. they got a yeah. problem. Yeah, no. Point, point number five. Sorry. That's but the good five. thing is they're actually completely mana. Uh, not completely mana reliant. They just they don't need mana at all. Junkrat does not need mana for his abilities, you can spam all day and, uh, and Oriel can use the healing. Oh yeah, you, yeah, you all mean the time. Team Weak Potato, the red team. That yeah. was like... Well, well, since when Lily doesn't need mana? Oh, is this another dead Junkrat? No, it isn't. Since the rework of Chen, you know. Ah yeah, alright, okay. Um, ta Talons, uh, we, ha we do it. Wait... Oh, that's the cleanse so of the engage lead. The engage onto the junk red, and the junk red falls. Nine. Not dodging the grenades. That's Space crap is the star of this game. Yeah, the Phoenix is actually doing a great job. And we see pressure against the port. Alright, we have Lily's cleanse. Five seconds, and then it's over. It's pretty Oh, yeah, right. I don't even need to talk about the talents anymore. Jeez. Game's over. <laughs> this crab is so fat. All right, <laughs> Bradfru takes guys. the one zero lead over the weak potatoes. On the left hand side, the team in blue. It is Team Weak Potatoes with DJ Brambas on the Genji with the stealthiest Genji skin ever, and Merc on the Anna, both riding the stylish tubestone. And on the right side we have the team Redfruit with Mango on the Malfurion on Bread Bucket and a new scene Hanzo. Damn this mounts on team. Yeah, Big Potatoes is awesome. The mounts of uh, the, the the mounts of wheat potatoes, they're awesome. Alright, the talents. We have we auto attack Hanzo. Oh. An auto attack Hanzo. Yeah, Malfurion. Nothing you wait, Genji is quite low already. <laughs> Uh, grenade calibration on the Anna. Interesting. Nice, that's interesting. I would have expected an Q build on Hanzo. Yeah, that w Whoa! But he, he mean, really packs a punch, so... It's really easy to get your Q quest completed on 2v2. You just need to hit two, uh, both heroes three times, that's not e bad, uh, not uh, hard. Yeah, that's right. And then you get the extra range, with, uh, which is like enough to shoot across half the map. Yeah, that's and true. That's true. Damage. There comes the Genji. Uh, the 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 Genji and uh, and uh, God engage. Not uh, doing that much damage. The heal prevention on the Malfurion. But the thing so is, far, the energy is quite low damage in early game. That's right. That's actually right. I don't know it's a good, it's, if it's enough to succeed against the healer. But That's on the damage. other hand, uh, Hanzo does really have high damage for the early game. Yeah, it's sick. I mean, he got in, in level 1, he got 100 damage on his auto attacks. That's insane. Yeah, that's really, really insane. Uh, 
Yeah. Oh, there goes, there goes there goes the first root, and that's almost dead, Genji. I mean, if you compare it, Hanzo got already 200 auto attack damage, and Genji only 47. Yeah. It's like day and night. And he already has his auto attack quest completed, which gives him really, really. No, one stack is missing. Yeah, it, I I just checked. He he's not. Yeah, he, he's complete. he's not finished yet. But it doesn't take that long. One stack and you get 50% attack speed and then it's... Yeah, that is, that's that's insane then. It's now it it's complete. Now it but yeah. only as long as he lives, so he can't allow himself Oh to yeah, this attack speed is insane. Alright, Genji just setting up a little bit of a trap to you? No, just picking the just glow. Just wanted to mana. Look at that attack speed. Yeah, that attack speed combined with that damage, it's insane. And this on point oh, root. Oh damn it. Yeah, this on that, point was, root. that was great. Mm -hmm. That was really, mm -hmm. really greatly executed. That was awesome. Alright, so we have the first point over to uh, Team Breadfruit. And it seems. And there you see, that's a good example. Even with an OP hero as Anna in this format, you can still get outdrafted. Yeah, that's right. That's absolutely right. All it takes is a Hanzo. <laughs> well, I, I mean, exactly have it said like that, but yeah. I mean, there are more heroes that you could pick to outdraft an Anna, but Ragnar was, for example. Yeah, oh, absolutely. <laughs> or Murky. Uh, or Murky, the fourth prime evil. The butcher, definitely. Um, yeah, but wave clear, definitely, definitely on the side of uh, of Team Breadfruit. Now they're doing the first structure damage. The tower is almost dead already. And l let's see what, which patterns they pick. Yeah, the classical Swift Strike Genji, that's okay. Oh yeah, oh, the overdose on the Ana. That's, uh, that's great too. Yeah. Vengeful Roots again. And ignore all distractions. Instant kill on the minions. And that's actually great. That's actually great. With the increased attack speed and the insta kill on minions, you can push the lane. Already uh, five points for Team Breadfruit. What? Three. Uh, three. Yeah, I was about to My say five. My overlay is buggy again. Did I miss two kills again? Uh, all right, but th there we do have an engage onto the Hanzo. Yo, he almost dies due to the Genji. But. Just almost. And the next engage onto the Hanzo, but the Genji has to get out of yeah. there. They enter That's early over Genji is starting to good to good uh, to, to provide a good of damage. Yeah, right. But they but... use that can we tap? Yes. Alright. So we have Oh in, in another really nice route onto Merc. But it's not enough to kill, and now Hanzo falls low on health. All right, just collect, uh, just collecting the globe down here real quick. Mango going up, Brad bucket low on life, but Genji rooted inside the uh, tower range. What? He won't die. He has he had his deflect up and. That was enough to take care of the tower shots. That's so far one and a half minutes left. And yeah. One and a half minutes left. And three points behind. So what do you think? Is I think this game is pretty much set to be honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goes, yeah goes Ge Genji, Genji goes down. They just can't the kill their no. Tenzo. The Tenzo with auto attack completed it, quest is just a beast. Yeah, his his auto attack he quest already is two hundred fifty auto attack damage with this insane attack speed. Yeah, that that's insane. That's really really insane. That's another one. I mean, it's two hundred fifty damage per second. It's sick. Look how much damage he does. That's insane. 
I want to see Malganus today. I want to see Malganus. Malganus and Ragnaros gegen yeah. double team. <laughs> totally. All right, and there goes another Genji. Oh no, Genji is getting away. I think. Yeah, Genji Great is Hansel, getting away. Great Hansel. <laughs> <laughs> Straight into tower and dead. Yeah, no, no, no. Um, <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so. But game's basically over. Ten oh, that rude again! That was that rude again. Ah, uh, these roots are great. Yep. And then there goes Vienna. The and these are enough points. Makes it a 2-0 win for Breadfruit.